Okay. I'm still in my pajamas. It's 1.30. Okay. So I have two shames and a pride. Shame number one. Vietnamese cold brew. I don't know how I made it home without taking a single sip of it. Shame number two. My favorite donut from Krispy Kreme. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. And then my pride is I got a planner. My room is just on the right part of the building to where it doesn't get the daytime heat blasted on it. And it also just keeps the coolness from the night. Uh, just kind of retains it. The coffee and donut are kind of my last hoorahs. I don't really believe in like gorging the last time you're gonna have something or or something because I don't really care about food like that. The few things that I like, I really like. Like I love Thai food or Thai curry. You don't see me eating Thai curry every week. I'm kind of bored with myself, I think. I don't know. You know how I said on my first day at, at this job, I was like, yeah, it kind of feels, feels like I've been working there for five years because I was instantly in it. Like, not that I instantly understood everything I had to do, I still don't understand everything, I'm still learning. But even still, it feels like I've been there for five years. Not like I'm in a rut, not like I'm bored with it, I'm just already comfortable. But school, like every year, there's this point where I get to where I'm like, man, why am I even bothering with this? Degrees aren't that important, right? You can get a great job with no degree. You just need the experience, and I don't have the experience. That's what was so gosh darn motivating to, to get a job, and that wasn't working out in Japan. Coming here, that's what was so motivating. Knowing that experience is, is, I don't know, it's so valuable. I wanted to get specifically a planner, break it down into the day, and the hours of the day so that when I have like when it says I wake up I'm co I like I'm consistent with it right and then when it says to go to sleep um it says when I start getting ready for bed because it can take 20 minutes if I if I like just want to put away some clothes or if I want to get my shirts ready for the next day real quick or I'm washing my face and teeth and and just everything anything or pre-setting out my workout clothes or something right all these extra little things that like aren't don't get scheduled in. <laughs> the reason I got the coffee and the donuts was because I do pretty good at home of eating what I want when I want because I want to eat properly, right? I have well these last couple weeks it was cherry a bag of cherries and a bag of grapes. I would take those for lunch and then I'd have like two packets of tuna and then I have either tilapia or chicken and I think this upcoming week when I go grocery shopping tomorrow um, I might go to tofu this way I'm changing out three things and that means more variety um, um, and then I'll, I have plenty of broccoli right I love my broccoli it's a good man and I don't need to drink the amount of coffee that I do drink it's a little unreasonable I think I like coffee so much because I think of how nice it is and they're my favorite times um, just sitting and talking with Sam or Lizzie or just whatever friends that I go to coffee or tea with whatever those are my favorite times sitting and talking and and because I feel like when I'm talking with someone we get a chance I get a chance to think Right? I have way too much sugar at work in terms of, oh, there's candy on, on Debbie's desk and she has it out for anybody to have. And so, oh, I'll have a piece, I'll have a piece. I feel so gluttonous just taking so much that someone else is giving out. Um, and I don't want to. Or someone brings in donuts and I'm going to include like what I'm going to eat and what I'm going to stick with in my eatings in here also. I did that in high school so effective especially when i could see what i'm eating and how much i'm doing side by side when i'm bored usually i want to make a change with things so yeah man that's what's up i like the organization i have with that before like the last couple years 
I didn't need it. But I think taking multiple classes, like more classes than a regular schedule consisted of, made it made me feel kind of burned out with school. And then the current professor that I have is kind of made, like reinforcing that burned out feeling of like, ah, I don't hate school. I hate certain parts of school. I don't hate professors or students. There's just certain aspects that are just like, eh, I don't have to deal with this. And there's one easy thing to do, just quit. I don't like quitting and I don't like cheating. Stopping things because they're hard or taking the easy way out on things, those I don't think benefit anyone. And I feel like if you do anything, do it to the absolute best of your ability. Thanks for listening, babes. Hopefully I cut this up properly so I, you didn't hear too much or I didn't ramble too much. Nah, who are we kidding? <laughs> I'm taking out my trash. So yeah, less sugar, less coffee, more schedule, better life. While I'm out and about, let's go see where my new parking spot is. It's in the basement. So I don't know where this stairs are to go down to the basement because I parked so high so I'll have to figure that out well this is already different hello yes I'm in my slippers <laughs> oh man oh man these are in the 20s I definitely parked farther than the 20s. No? Wait. Ah, it's gonna be on angled parking. Ah. Wait. 73, 101. Oh, that's me. Oh, man. Well, no one's door will slam into mine. I might as well walk to my room now. So over here is the ele is the alternate elevator from when they fixed my my little wheel down here. I think they just gave me a new door. Cause at first I was like, why the heck is this thing so scuzzy? Like look look at the scuzz. You can't see it. At the right angle you can see the scuzz. But I like to keep my doors clean, like so. So I was like, where the what the heck? But since it's not cracked down here. I, I figured they must have just replaced it. <clears throat> yeah. So, they sent you, they send a, how was your experience survey? Boop. Easy as pie. Already using my planner. Things I need to do for Monday. So, oh, Rumi's and I went, we were talking, went to Starbucks, kept talking. Uh, now it's about, oh, it's 1.30 in the morning, and we're cleaning, because uh, we got Sunday, Monday, and then girls gotta be out by noon on Tuesday. I gotta be in the other room by noon on Tuesday. And, yeah, we clean with things. So, other than being as unproductive as hell to, by watching freaking Facebook videos. Uh, now, it's time to get down to business with this stove. The grit. Yeah. The nasty. <laughs> but other than that, I'm clean a little bit, and then go sleep. Mm -hmm. Talk to you tomorrow, babes. Uh, I didn't put my videos together. I didn't finish my homework. I did nothing productive. Nothing productive today. So, well, I guess technically yesterday. Now it's Sunday. <laughs> Alright, I love you so much, babes. And I'll talk to you tomorrow. Good day.